Hey guys, it's Nick here. Just another little update on Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Now, I do plan, like I said, I do plan on finishing the game, but there's a few things I need to tell you guys about. First off, there will not be a video of Night 3 completed, and the reason for that is because I already beat it. Now, I was recording it, but then my phone was saying that I didn't have enough space, even though now all of a sudden I can record 10 minute videos, no problem. But um, that didn't even, for some reason, didn't want me to do it. But my plan is if I could finish the game on like nightmare mode and stuff, which I doubt I'll be able to, but then again, I've beaten the other two, so maybe. Anyways, if I beat it on nightmare mode, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back and I'm going to play through it again a second time so I can get the good ending. And if I knew how to get the good ending before I started playing the game, I would have, you know, done that and get it. Excuse me. Um, what the cool thing is Scott Cawthon has pretty much confirmed an iPhone version because he released the Android version But he said there were some problems with it. So he had to pull it from their store or whatever. So he, he said until you know, he you know, he'll release the game again on Android when he fixes the, the said problems, but Anyways, the funny thing is on the PC version I was having my own little problem with the game and that is I die go back to the menu You know, I'd load the game to try again, and then the game would crash after it says, you know, night 3, 12 a.m., whatever, the game would crash, you know. So I was like, you know, I tried to contact Steam, but they only led me to, you know, Scott Cawthon's site. So I just posted a little forum topic about it. And then, you know, I decided, well, he's not going to reply, but I'll send Scott an email anyway. And then something interesting happened. <laughs> so I go to the Five Nights at Freddy's page on the Steam store just because I wanted to see like what the requirements was cause, were because I thought maybe I would need like you know Windows 7 or something. For those of you who don't know I'm on XP still for certain reasons but anyways so funny thing is he said that he made a patch just for that so um or you know not for the same exact problem I was having but he said you know it caused the game this bug caused the game to crash before you know, level loaded or whatever, and I was like, well, that sounds like what's happening to me, so I guess, you know, so I tried the game again, and of course, I had to, I had attempted two times in order, to, two more times to beat it, and all, it took me like 30 attempts to beat Night 3, it was not easy at all, and I'm pretty sure Night 4 is not to be a walk in the park either, but anyways, so I, you know, I, tr I get killed, you know, and I tried to level again and it loads, so I'm going to assume that it does work now. So, hopefully that is the case. You know, um, another thing I want to talk about is, um, is this going to be the last FNAF game? Well, some people say yes, and by some I mean most, and then others say no. Now, the reason why people say that this is the last game is because you end up, spoiler, turn off the video if you don't want to, you know, go back if you don't want to hear you know, don't want to be spoiled. Anyways, it turns out that in the third game, you end up releasing the children's souls, at least if you try to get the good ending. So, um, I guess, you know, maybe it is the, maybe it is the last game. However, and then another thing is on Scott Cawthon's website, if you go there, it just shows Freddy's hat on the floor and little spotlights on there. But there's some shadows in the spotlight, like, not like animatronics or anything, but like, okay, it's like one of those, you know, funnel shaped you know lights or whatever but there's like there's like some kind of shape here I'd, I'd have to show you guys if I can get my damn website to load up let me see anyways so the, it someone some people are saying that means that that's gonna be the last game and whatever but um some people believe that's not the case okay so I don't, god this is gonna be really hard to see in fact I don't think I can even show you guys it's like well, go to scottgames.com, you'll notice that, well, actually, I guess I was wrong, it's not like a funnel-shaped light, it's actually like this, but there's some stuff, like, you can see the shadow, like, right here, then the shadow here looks kind of weird, so, yeah, I don't know, maybe there's going to be another game. Some people do think there's going to be another game, because, a fourth installment, because, um, in the second game, they mentioned something called, like, Fredbear's Family Diner, or something like that, so... We'll see what happens. Now, at first, I was like, well, I'm glad this is the last one because these games are going to start getting really repetitive. But um, now it's like, oh, well, that, that's kind of a shame. But, you know, it's his series. He can end it whenever he wants to, I guess. But, uh, firstly, I won't end a series that is making a lot of dough. You know what I mean? I mean, that if it's making him a lot of money, I'd keep finding ways to expand, you know, 
the F and F universe, you know. So, anyways, I, I, you know, I'm gonna try night four, and that's the plan to beat, beat the game completely, like on nightmare mode and everything. But the plan might be canceled because I don't know if I can do it. But I'm gonna try. Okay, I will try. And um, I guess that's about it. Oh, shit. Something else I want to mention. Oh, yeah. Um, game review I was making is postponed because I was not expecting FNAF 3 to be released. I was I just saw Markiplier's Facebook page. You know, I was scrolling up in the news feed on Facebook, and all of a sudden, there he is, you know, playing the third game. And I'm like, no, the game could have been released that soon. I mean, people were saying, you know, the game wouldn't have been done till like, December of this year or something. But, nope. This game was actually made, you know or was released on March 2nd, so isn't that funny, <laughs> you know? So that's why I was postponed, because I was going to dedicate some of my time to playing it. The good news is for the game review, all I really need to do is if I can get the damn capture software working, all I need to do is record some gameplay footage, and then I can easily edit it together in, you know, Adobe Premiere and, you know, get that uploaded. But, like I said, it's not like postpone, you know, what I mean by postpone is I'm probably not going to work on it until like next week. And by next week, I mean like in the next few days, starting that week, you know. So, that's about it. One other thing, though, is that I watched um, the first part of Braveheart. There's two VHSs. I'm not going to watch both of them now, but anyways, it was a pretty good movie. And it's funny because, you know, I'm English and I'm Scottish, you know. That's some of my heritage, so I just found that kind of funny. Anyways, so I'm going to enjoy a piece of some of Freddy Fazbear's pizza, and I'll see you guys later. Have a great weekend, happy Friday, and peace out. You guys kick ass, keep kicking ass.